Well, the young rookie right-hander, Herman Gonzalez, will now come on to pitch for the Minnesota Twins. Steve Shields out of there. And the Blue Jays coming back in the seventh inning. But Gonzalez with a record of 3-1 and one and a nice earned run average. He'll try to shut him down here in the eighth inning. At Wrigley Field, the Astros win by a score of one to nothing. Bob Nepper, who's been struggling this year, is the winning pitcher. Dave Smith gets the save. Greg Maddox, the loser. Each club with just three hits. The Astros winning one to nothing. Don't forget, this is just the first game of a doubleheader here on NBC. Many of you will see the Yankees and the Angels after this game. Some of you to see the Brewers and the Athletics. Strike to George Bell. Nothing really tricky about Gonzalez. Fastball slider, but his fastball moves all over the place. It's tricky about him, Bobby, and you watch this. Gonzalez throws from the first base side of the rubber, and he falls off the first base side, so the right-handed batters actually get a great look at him. Maybe a better look at him than a left-hander does. Fastball. That ball really dove down and in on George Bell. And Bell, as he switches that weight back to the backside, he would way back or way out on his front foot. He's normally a low ball hitter, too. Whoops. There he goes. <laughs> the deception of Gonzalez. 